Hey, good meat users. Hope you're doing great. In this quick video, I'll guide you through the step-by-step -step process of integrating Google Meet with the Good Meat plugin inside your WordPress site. Let's begin. From your WordPress dashboard, go to the Good Meat menu on the left and click on Settings. On the Settings page, you'll find a section titled Set Up Your Google Meet Integration. There, you'll see the redirect URL. This is required when configuring your project in the Google Developer Console. We've also attached a tutorial link to guide you through the setup, along with a direct link to visit the Google Developer Console. Click the link to visit the Google Developer Console, or you can navigate to it manually if you prefer. To obtain the JSON file, you need to create credentials. First, click on Select Project, then click on New Project. Provide a name and then click on Create Project. After creating the project, go to the Enable APIS and Services tab on this page. Click on Enable APIS and Services. In the search bar, type Google Calendar API. Click on the first result. and enable this API. Next on the Google Calendar API screen, locate the Create Credentials button. Click on it to configure credentials for this API. Select the API type it's already selected, then choose User Data and click Next. Now fill in the app information for the OAuth consent screen. Enter the app name. Add a user support email. And finally provide a developer contact email. Then click Save and Continue. Since we're not adding any scopes, click Save and Continue. Now for the OAuth client ID, select Web Application as the application type. Once selected, give it a name. Next, we need to add the authorized redirect URL. Go to your Good Meet Settings page. Copy the redirect URL and paste it into the redirect URI section on the Google Console. Once that's done, click Create. Now you can download the JSON file. Once the download is complete, click Done. We're almost done, but there's one last step. Before we go back to GoodMeet, go to the Oath Consent screen and click the Publish App button. Once the app is published, it's ready to be used with GoodMeet. Now, back in GoodMeet, upload the JSON file you downloaded. You can either drag and drop the file or select it manually. Once you select and upload the JSON file, if it's valid, you'll be taken to the consent screen. At this point, click on Go to Google's consent screen button to set up your email and grant the necessary permissions. Once you've granted all the permissions, you will see the screen confirming that the Google Meet account is activated. That's it. You're now ready to create meetings. However, if you need to reset the credentials, you can do so using the Reset Credentials button. If you want to change the account, click the Change Account button. That's all. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe.